can use also technology and analytics to develop a different type of audience. What happened in China, for example, for the first time, I think this year, the sixth uh, highest grossing movie in the world was, is a Chinese uh, production. So, and that's mainly being sold in China, but it's making the same numbers as Disney studios that are released elsewhere. So, um, do you think that could be a, a way for, let's say, Latin American countries, developing countries to, to work, try to develop their own audience and how, maybe? I think there's a, a kind of similarity between um, Colombia and the Colombian um, film industry and the, um, and the German film industry because um, we, were, we in Germany, we were not used to do products which have a global appeal. So there are some and they always deal with the same topics, uh, very, um, very German topics. And, um, but, but we are not used to that. But now when Netflix and Amazon are coming in, um, there is a lot of, yeah, novel approaches um, and what we see is that now people outside of Germany are interested in watching and basically paying attention to German productions and that's very much um, what can happen here so you can produce something not everything that happens in in, in Colombia is of global interest that's for sure and the same for Germany but there are a lot of things which are of global interest, either because they are just stories about love and fear and sadness and passion, um, which are of global nature, of a global nature, or they are about the things that happen in your country, have happened in your country, and about the beauty of your country, which the world is eager for looking at, which, which at this point so far was just not has just, uh, ju uh, has just not happened uh, because there were no distribution um, channels. And so I think, so the question would then be, is Netflix the solution? No, it's not. Um, it can be a partner, um, but it should not be the only um, partner. So it should be a mix of um, theatrical um, deals, um, streaming deals, and, and maybe even, even totally other um, uh, distribution ways. But this is where we are. It's all conventions now, but you, you find a lot of ways um, to smuggle through these conventions and break these conventions. Um, this is what the digital era means for us, and I think that's what local uh, producers and local filmmakers and musicians, um, they need to pay attention to and they make, uh, take, uh, generate an advantage for themselves.